of National Science Day in our school. Here are some great discoveries which our school student exhibited. Hello guys, welcome back to Lucky Stick Wheel channel. On account of National Science Day, I have made a drone model using two ice cream sticks, four motors, four plepperers, and rechargeable battery at 1.5 mm wire. Here, I am explaining the drone model to some of the parents who came to view the exhibition. Here, I am keeping the negative wire to positive point and the positive wire to negative point. The drone will not able to fly because the air is coming upwards. Now, I am keeping the negative wire to negative point and positive wire to positive point. The drone will try to fly now. See how it works? It's only for experimental purpose. Here comes my friend's project. This is an ear structure which consists of outer ear, ear canal, middle ear, inner ear, ear drum and auditory nerve. Next comes the skin structure showing epidermis, dermis, connective tissue, hair follicles and sweat glands. Here is an amazing idea of presenting an air cooler with a plastic jar filled with ice cubes connected to a battery. When this fan is switched on, it releases a cool breeze. Don't you think it's an innovative presentation? Then comes a brain model where you can see all three regions of the brain. The cerebrum, cerebellum and the medulla. As we all know that cerebrum is the largest part of the brain which composes of left and right hemispheres. Here's a heart structure showing the different chambers of heart, right auricle, left auricle, right ventricle, left ventricle along with arteries and veins. Our heart is of our fist size. Wow! A projected model displayed here. Projectors generally help students for better presentations, better use of class time and great teaching versatility. You can see here the projector light. Here comes a hydraulic road which has been technically constructed and isn't this helpful in this modern world? Wow! It's really amazing! See how it's working! is a JCB model presented as we all know JCBs are used for heavy purposes and substantial works in different fields like agriculture, construction and demolition. See how it works. Here is an Arduino based home automation Bluetooth technology used to on the fan, light etc. Here can you see they are switching on the light with the help of their app in their phone installed. Just check how they are operating. Here comes another amazing concept of patient monitoring system working model where they check patient's temperature, blood pressure and also the cardinal direction of patient facing towards. See how it works. Here is my favorite robot coming. The robots are automatically operated machines that replaces human effort. a vast universe with sun in the middle and all other planets revolving around it and this is called solar system. Here is a water cycle model showing evaporation, condensation and precipitation. Here is a ball and stick model of methane. Here comes our mass orbiter mission Mangalyan. It was actually launched on 5th November 2013 by ISRO. Here are some gases and their combinations have been displayed. Here 
comes GSLV Mark II satellite launch vehicle which is a three stage medium lift launch vehicle developed by ISRO. Hydroponics is a concept where the nutrients are delivered to the plant roots from waste released from the fish tank. Here you can see fish tank in the bottom level, roots in the middle level and growing plants in the upper level. Here is a Venus flytrap plant. The speciality of this plant is they trap the insect when they sit on it. Here is a car robot that follows a sensor magnetic tape and similar technology is used in self-driven cars. I am feeling happy and great that my seniors did this on National Science Day. This is a chart which is showing our lungs. And this is the working model of lungs. They are showing how to prevent lungs without infection and how to keep our lungs healthy and etc. And this kit is showing our sense organ model. And my friend is explaining about the solar eclipse and lunar eclipse. This little girl was spinning a windmill and the power was generated to that light. This kid is explaining the method of generating the hydroelectric energy. This demo is all about wastewater management and treatment. And this girl is showing how the molecules are in solid state, liquid state and gaseous state. And this little boy is explaining about the bones of our body. See how creatively he picturized our bones. And my friend was explaining about the eye. The brain gets information from the optic nerve which the eye is sending. And my another friend made a ribcage model which is protecting the heart and it is made out of paper. Wow, how innovative. And this little girl is showing the whole skeletal system in our body. When we are infants, there will be more than 300 bones and when we grow up, there will be 206 bones. So I request everyone to explore science to get more innovative ideas to make our country best in the world in science and technology. I know my budding scientists, each one of you in future will contribute great discoveries to this world. Happy National Science Day!